Premier fencing coach Tamir Tahoun, you were in Egypt, your your uh, home country, over the the holidays for training camp. What what kinds of information are you bringing back and most excited to to kind of start implementing with your students? Uh, yes, first it, it, it was on vacation because I, I hadn't any time to, to see my my parents, uh, but uh, I, I was happy. The training there was so good. Uh, the national team allowed us to train with them. They have uh, very good uh, use uh, fencers and also uh, uh, we fence with some Olympian uh, fencers. So my, my, my fencers uh, uh, got like, uh, good training, I think, and uh, I like it. It's a few days, like five days, and we fence in like uh, Egypt Cup uh, for two days. So it's, it, it was a good period for, uh, for training. Uh, yeah, I like it. And and with it, how was the time divided? Was there a focus on, you know, one day on technique? Was there another day of, of bouting drills, footwork? How, how did how was the com- camp structured? We did it like um, uh, a short period, like five days. So the first three days we starting with uh, fitness session with, uh, with a very good uh, fitness uh, trainer. Okay, he did like. 45 minutes with this first, and then we, we uh, every day we uh, we did like something different. Like, as, as you said, now we start with uh, some technique and uh, and uh, with drills, okay, and free fencing for uh, for everybody to to know uh, each other. And second day we made something different, uh, some uh, some I give some tactics, okay, and we did like a, something like uh, some change, like individual competition between the kids. Uh, girls and, and boys, and then we, we did like uh, something fun, like team events. Okay, so every day we, we did something different, and uh, it, it was fun. How how did that camp with you know many of the top Egyptian fencers compare to a camp you might attend here in the U.S.? Maybe a, a national team camp at Summer Nationals or any other camp? Uh, when when I think about we we change the place, and I, I just first thinking was change the because every, every time we, we, we're doing the winter, winter camp in the club, winter camp in the club like every year. Sometimes we bring uh, like famous fencers and sometimes we are not. But this time I, I think to, we change to do something something new. That's why I, 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 of course we, we can uh, spend the holiday in uh, in the warmer place is, uh, is what I think and also good for fencing. And that's uh, that's happening. That's happening. Now, Egyptian, uh, the Egyptians are strong in, in fencing. Uh, and, you know, we see that even here today with Hasbak of, of Notre Dame making the, the eight. Muhammad Hassan did like top 16. Yeah, yeah. So there's definitely representation here in a very strong Div 1 men's foil event. What, what, was, uh, what was the number one thing that you took away from this Egyptian camp that you're now bringing back for your coaching? Um, just uh, we, in, in Egypt, they, they, uh, they haven't like uh, many, uh, like, uh, like a lot of fun to do like, uh, a lot of camps for international competition, but Egypt close to you, so it's easy to go on back, but for fun, it's still, it's, uh, it's a big issue. Okay, so the, the, the people, or kids, or clubs, or coaches working hard. That's how I believe so. It's working hard, and, and the kid is so serious, uh, mentality tough. That's why we, we, we have many, like, uh, not many, like, very few, but very good fences. Very good fences coming from uh, this culture, because it's tough culture. The life is not easy, so they, they want to do something. They want to do something. It's not easy. They want to attend college like here. They come to attend college here. They, so they know they have to work first, work hard first to to uh, to, to get something. Uh, this is what what I want my kids see from my country. They have to be uh, uh, more aggressive, uh, more tough, uh, be serious, and work hard to, to get what they want. So it's not so much about the fencing specific 
knowledge you brought back, but it's more about what your fencers from Premier were able to experience and observe in yeah, Egypt. What, what I think is that the training of horses, it's a very important thing. The coach is very important, but, uh, but the kids, his talent, is serious. Because many kids, many kids are t talented already, but, uh, but not serious enough to be something. Okay, some, ki some, some, some kids not talented, but they're working hard to be something. Okay, to do whatever they want, and to be a world champion, maybe a national champion. So they, they want to first to work hard with them. It depends on the kids. It depends on the kids. And then the training and the coach, the system after that, but it depends on the kids. If the kids is talented and, and work hard, it's okay. Not talented and, and work hard, maybe it, it will be something. They have to work hard and to have to believe themselves. All right, well, great way to start off the new year. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.